Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some uh, new desserts. These are actually distributed by Kraft Heinz Food Company. Um, I have the Hershey's Cookies and Cream Colliders Twisted. And I have the Reese's Colliders Layered. Uh, these were $2.99 each, but from two different stores. We found the Cookies and Cream in Minor, and we found the Reese's in Kroger, but both the same price, $2.99, and you get two desserts um, in each package. So, I was gonna try to open it without, I did. I opened it without, without ripping it apart. Okay, there you go. Um, very convenient if you wanna take them to work, put them in your refrigerator at work. They do you need to- You have to fight to get the top off. They do need to stay refrigerated. That's where we found these. We found them um, in the refrigerated, um, department um and they're around the yogurt area so if yeah. you start looking around the yogurt yogurt pudding stuff like that there yeah the refrigerated puddings you'll find these we have not seen these in like walmart um yeah i don't know if walmart just hasn't gotten them yet or if they're not getting them till later i don't know what the deal is but we have been in several different Walmarts and none of, even bigger Walmarts, none of them around us has them yet. So this is the Hershey's Cookies and Cream Colliders Twisted Vanilla Flavored Dessert. We have reviewed some of these before and it was like vanilla pudding uh, with chocolate cookie crumbles. It's, I don't know how that's Hershey's. Try one, it tastes like a, a bitter Oreo. You don't have to get a lot, it's, it, you'll taste it. <laughs> Doesn't that taste like just an Oreo kind of flavor? It, it does though. It's got that bitter chocolate. It's very, very bitter, very biting, but it does remind you of a crumbled Oreo, mm -hmm. just the cookie portion. Um, this is 210 calories for the dessert. But they stay good for a little while, so this is good for like another uh, month and a half. So. It's vanilla pudding with Oreos. The, the, literally, literally vanilla pudding. Yeah. Um, like if you buy one of those snack pack puddings, although I think I like the snack pack brand better. Yeah. Um, that's not bad, but what's bad is that cookie. I do not like that bitter cookie. Yeah, at all. it's so bitter that, that that's what I'm left with is mm -hmm. the bitter flavor. Of and course, some people love that bitter flavor. But. There's absolutely, though, Honestly, you're kind of running it. You're running your dessert because that cookie on top is so very, very bitter. It, it just, to me, it runs it. Mm. I love the sweet pudding. Yeah, I would really love the pudding. <laughs> um, it does not remind yeah, you that. of the cookies and cream candy bar because the, the Hershey's cookies and cream candy bar is sweet. Mm. You know, that white cream, well, just like this, the white part is sweet. But in those candy bars, you don't get bitter. No, I mean it might be, but it's such small pieces that it, you can't tell. No, it doesn't, and, and now they're making it with more cookies. Uh, but you you just don't get any bitterness at all. It's it's a it starts sweet and ends sweet. Uh, it's the whole experience is a sweet candy bar. I think a lot of people. I don't know that children children have very young new taste buds you know they don't have old taste buds <laughs> and so that is gonna i think come as a shock to a lot of children yeah, pretty bitter. um yeah and again uh well no gavin no i was gonna say gavin never liked the the oreo part of the cookie anyway he always ate the cream ate the out cream. of it and threw yeah, the Oreos yeah. And he'd stack them <laughs> yeah gavin uh, he would not our grandson he would not be yeah. interested in that i don't think i think that's way too bitter for him um i would not get that again I would because you could go and buy pudding and it's a lot of fewer calories too. Um, yeah, that's a lot of calories, 210 calories. Yeah, because you can get pudding for like 60, 70. Yeah. And you can get the sugar-free kind and you never even know it's sugar-free. Uh -huh. You can't no, even that's tell. That's the ones that are Yeah, you, can, you can't tell at all. Um, these are the Reese's Colliders layered. Now we tried one of the Reese's before and it was like a powder on top. Mm -hmm. So this is just layered. You don't add anything to it. It's already done for you. So yeah, this it's basically is basically two um, layers of pudding. Yeah, it's peanut butter flavored dessert. I like how they're calling it dessert. It's pudding. 
peanut butter flavored dessert with rich milk chocolate topping. And this one's only 180 calories. So the cookies and cream was actually more calories. But it does look like peanut butter down there. Mm -hmm. I've never had a peanut butter pudding, so. Mm -hmm. I'd like to try that. So. I think it's the reason why they don't make peanut butter pudding. It's not horrible. No. But the peanut butter tastes very artificial. Or maybe it's just the chocolate for me. Something in there tastes artificial. I just, I, it's okay. I don't have a Reese's cup. <laughs> well, that's what I was going to say. It has the Reese's name on it, yeah, this, but it doesn't taste like Reese's peanut butter. There's nothing about that that tastes like Reese's peanut butter. No. Well. At least the other one that had the pieces on top on, basically you had a pudding and you were sprinkling crushed up uh, Reese's cups on top of it. Um, that was actually decent. But, uh, but this is, yeah, I just don't like it. I tell you what it tastes like. It tastes like watered down peanut butter. Yeah. So you do, you do get a peanut you butter flavor, a little bit of it. but it's just very, very watered down, which makes sense because it's pudding. And Reese's is, uh, the classic Reese's peanut butter has a grittiness to it and it's phenomenal and it's a strong peanut butter. It's incredibly sweet. You're not getting any of that Reese's experience when they put it in this pudding because it is watered down. Um, I would skip this one, and if you want the Reese's experience, then get the other one that we yeah, got, so. the one with the the crumble on top. So it's like this. You had a crumble. It's um. So they're all called colliders. This one's twisted. That's what it was called. Twisted. It was Reese's twisted, and you added the little cup on the if you want that experience but if you wanted to save money you could buy your own of course it's um it, you could buy your own vanilla pudding our chocolate pudding and then buy uh reese's and put it on top and i in the long run it's going to save you money mm -hmm. because you're going to be able to make a lot of individual desserts out of those things that you buy so it might cost you more money up front but in the long run it's going to be you're going to make a lot more individual desserts so i would go that <laughs> route i would i would skip both of these yeah i didn't really care for either one of these some yeah. of the other ones I've liked. These are just, yeah. And the chocolate in this one, it just tastes like chocolate pudding. Yeah, and chocolate pudding is a hit or miss. Anyway. Yeah, they're avoiding the word pudding on this these packages. I think they realize that if people if people think, oh, we can get pudding a lot cheaper. At uh, lower calories. Yeah, at lower calories, they won't want to buy these. So I'm trying to help you out here. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.